Okay guys, quick, uh, just a quick um, vid showing you guys how to do uh, valve lapping. This is an Atomic 4, this is a valve. I've pretty much cleaned uh, the guides out, the valves have been steel brushed, um, they're in good shape. Um, what I did was, I went to the hardware store and these are one of those furniture kind of adjustable table legs. It cost me a buck and then I got a, a rubber washer. Uh, cost me 50 cents and that's like a little makeshift uh, valve tool um, atomic valves I think the uh, intake is one and a half and the exhaust is an inch this is just over but the valves stick over the uh, block so uh, it doesn't really make a difference right what I have here is some fine grinding paste and what you want to do is just get a little bit that's the valve seat right over there, that little semi-shiny part. You just want to smear a little bit of this um, all the way around. You don't want to gunk it on there, you don't want too much. Uh, it will spread as you turn around. Uh, so, no, you have to, that's fine. I don't usually put any on the valve seat. Um, what I also do is I just put a tiny bit of oil, WD-40, on the valve just to make sure that it's definitely spinning freely. And get it down into the... Uh, I think I have the wrong number here. That one is supposed to go there. But I think since it's safe to assume... Should be doing this one. That valve. I just did. That was number three. Okay. Anyways, I'll do it again quickly just to demonstrate. So, what you want to do is get the drill centered on the valve and just make sure the valve is actually spinning. And I'd say about five to eight seconds uh, should be plenty. And when the, uh, when the valve comes out, Hopefully you'll have a nice, um, let's see if I can get this to show up, it leaves like a nice shiny mark, there you go, on the valve, that's what you want to see when you're done, and that'll just mean that there's a good seal between the valve and the, uh, the block. Um, yeah, pretty much, hold the jaw straight, keep it, put it on slow speed, and um, just give it a few twists difficult with one hand because you have to steady the drill. You also can do this by hand and um, other things. I don't know, but uh, that should generally work. Thanks for watching guys. Cheers.